Hey everyone, welcome back to the show. It is time for us to talk about what is trending out there. Yeah, lots of interesting things going on today, including something I noticed yesterday on my Twitter feed, uh, the hashtag stuff Vancouverites say, now but it wasn't probably, stuff. It sounded more like pit Vancouverites say. And you're probably familiar with uh, the little video meme that's going around of stuff girls say, say stuff guys, guys say, say stuff. stuff people say, yada, anyway, yada, Anyway, so what's uh, this one? So uh, this is trending in Vancouver right now, and it's just everybody hashtags what they think uh, people say in Vancouver, things like... Uh, it's so sad that the mom and pop ca cafe I never went to shut down. You hear that a lot in Vancouver. <laughs> That's so true. Uh, you hear things like, I only pay $400 in rent. How many roommates do you have? Seven. Uh, you know, so it's actually, it's very funny. So if you hashtag. Uh, and check it out. And, but don't put stuff Vancouver, I'd say. That won't come up. Put. Uh, we got it. There you go. Put that in there as a hashtag. Now, the other exciting thing that's happened today is the Vancouver Whitecaps, uh, the MLS Super Draft happened today. I, as a Whitecaps season ticket holder, was very interested in this because we had the number two draft What's pick this year. What's the Super Draft? Uh, it's just what they call it. It's like Super. Super Draft. It sounds like they're superheroes. I, I believe the reason that they call it the Super Draft is it's all the incoming players that are eligible to join the league, so it's not existing players from other franchises or Europe. This Super is all the draft. new players, so guys through school systems and all that kind of Kind of stuff in the states so we selected a young man named darren maddox you can see him there in the uh in the video here where they're sort of talking and introducing him in vancouver jamaican lightning quick great striker great goal scorer but the other thing that i have for you is uh, a little video just to whet your appetite if you are a vancouver whitecaps fan of this young man in action wicked music Oh, he's gonna be good. I want my money back. I'm down there drowning in your back. You got me on my knees, praying for everything you lack. Like. Sounds like a good pick. Yeah, he's Looks gonna be like a lot of fun. Might, yeah. Uh, so you can go to YouTube and just search his name, Darren Maddox, and you'll find a little bit about him because I think you will be seeing him in the Whitecaps lineup now, next year. Now, the other big news was uh, what's going on with uh, the Canucks, more specifically, four of them. Yeah, absolutely. The Canucks have more players named to the NHL uh, All-Star game now than any other team in the West. Do we have more than Boston? Yeah, uh, no, uh, I think the Rangers have the most in the East. Vancouver has the most in the West. We have, uh, of course, both Sedins, Alex Edler, and uh, Cody Hodgson. Great choice for the rookie game this year. Of course, his first year in the league. He's number five in rookie scoring. He's going to the All-Star game. His first year in the league. Very cool. Alex Edler, I believe this is his first All-Star game. Awesome. And the Sedins, they're just the best damn players in the I'm league. I'm glad they, they, you know, both of them. I hate it when the Sedins get separated for anything. No, you can't do it. You can't. I remember, uh, no, they've never done it for an All-Star game either. Yeah. I think whenever one made it, both made it. Because I always worry about them when, like, if that were to happen. Well, I think they worry that the were wrong one. Were superpowers? Deplete. But if you take one Sedin for the All-Star game, what's to say that the other Sedin isn't showing up in his place? So you have to bring them both, otherwise they're going to prank. What if they do prank. a DNA test? How do they tell the difference? How do they do a DNA test? Over to you, Fiona. <laughs> um, on to something completely different, because, uh, well, it's about Justin Bieber, people. The Consumer oh. Electronics Show is happening in Las Vegas. It is where all the geeks unite. You know what? It's the time of year where all the products get doing? announced for what's going on in electronics, from cameras to tablets to televisions. Well, that's my question, so Michael. It's got to be censored. What is happening in this photograph? You know, the things they didn't think about when they launched this. We little, have to censor this. When this little <laughs> robot was launched is what it would look like if you put a microphone up to the speaker. Well, apparently, it's a robot that it works it's like a speaker. It's the greatest robot ever. I, I know, but every photograph on the internet of Justin Bieber is currently that. And I I had to just check out a video to see what was actually happening. It, it really is just a robot. Oh, oh, oh. it just popped out. It just popped out. Oh, wow. Anyway, I don't think they thought this one through. <laughs> it's it's a speaker. It's to play your music. So, why they would put the speaker? In the area. This is my question. Me. I don't know why. It's they got a whole that. face you could have used. It's got a mouth. It's got a chest. Ma'am, please speak into the microphone. Uh, I can't hear it. <laughs> I can't. I'm sorry. Hi, You're going to have to speak up. Uh, that's it. We are going to take a break. When we come